welcome everybody today i'm making quinoa fried rice quinoa um, fried rice for adil's lunch and i have a little bit of quinoa over here i would say here like a five spoon of quinoa i washed it and now i'm gonna boil it with a little bit of coconut oil and a little bit of paprika and salt pink salt you can see i put a little bit of paprika pink salt and coconut oil now i'm gonna turn on my stove and just boil so i have a little bit of paprika pink salt and coconut oil for my eggplant and i'm gonna just mix it everything and put it in the air fryer for cooking now i put my eggplant in the air fryer For fry, for the fried rice, I'm gonna scramble this egg and later on I'm gonna add it with my fried rice. My fried scrambled egg is ready, so I'm gonna keep it in the side. My egg is ready, and I covered this one in the foil paper so you can see it. Here is my quinoa. It's almost ready, so I'm gonna just add it with my eggplant and I'm just gonna add, put some mushroom in it. You can see my quinoa is ready. Now, again. it is optional. I just add a little bit of raisin with it. If your child doesn't like raisin, you don't have to add it, it's just optional. So I'm gonna just mix it with my quinoa, my raisin, and I'm gonna mix it with the rest of it. Okay, now I put my mushroom and quinoa and eggplant and my raisin in the fry pan. And a little bit of, uh, I'm gonna stir fry it. This step is also optional. I add a little bit of ketchup with it. If you don't like the ketchup, if you don't, if the child don't like the ketchup, you don't need to. Just a little bit. Just, I would say less than one teaspoon. Now I add my scrambling, and I think it's a good healthy diet and food. It has quinoa, which is a high in iron. Has omega, which is the egg, and vegetable, which is mushroom and eggplant, and some raisin. And let's see. If you like it, let me know. My quinoa fried rice is ready. Now I'm gonna serve in the lunch box. Now I serve it in the lunch box. I'm gonna pack it. And this is the look for the quinoa fried rice. And hopefully you're gonna like the recipe. Please let me know in the comments below if you have any question. And until then, thank you. Goodbye. Thanks for watching.